हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू डे 26 ऑफ नवंबर लीड को चैलेंज एंड टुडेस क्वेश्चन इज लॉन्गेस्ट ऑफ स्ट्रिंग विद के एट लीस्ट के रिपीटिंग कैरेक्टर्स सो एज द क्वेश्चन सेज यू नीड टू आइडेंटिफाई द लॉन्गेस्ट ऑफ स्ट्रिंग सच दैट ईच कैरेक्टर इट अपीयर्स एट लीस्ट के टाइम्स सच दैट द फ्रीक्वेंसी ऑफ ईच कैरेक्टर इज ग्रेटर देन और इक्वल टू के हाउ एवर इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन इट इज स्पेसिफाइड लेस देन और इक्वल टू के विच इज इन करेक्ट सो प्लीज डोंट गो बाई दिस डिस्क्रिप्शन इज एब्सोल्यूटली इन करेक्ट Uh, so let's go through the example that is specified here so uh, k in this case is 3 and the string is triple a double b so the longest substring where each character occurs three times at least three times is triple a and hence the length its length is 3 now let's look at the other example a a a a b c so so the longest substring where each character occurs at least two times is a b a b b so this substring and its length is 5 ab ab b and its length is 5 so uh that's the answer so without much ado let's quickly look at the algorithm that i have devised so longest substring with k repeating characters and uh, this is a simple two pointer approach that i'm going to follow so uh, and let's let's take a bigger example than what have been specified in the question the string is Triple A, double B, C, double D, A, E, double A, double F. So let me just take a pointer here, and uh, let's just talk about uh, how are we going to go about this. So first of all, we'll cal store the frequency of each character in a map. We'll create a frequency map, and we'll iterate through the string and calculate the frequency of each character. And whenever the frequency of any particular character is less than k however greater than 0 that's the position of split for example c c has a frequency 1 and f has a frequency 2 so let me ask you a question here will it be ever possible that you can generate any string uh, in as an answer that has c in it you can't because its frequency is 1 and similarly for e e is a also a similar case so you can never generate any the longest substring that contains c in it out of this substring and hence this is a these are the point of split that we need to identify so we need to split the string into two parts such that we need to recheck across this part and then again this part so how are we going to go about this so we will create a two we'll store two variables start and end and we'll iterate through the complete string and as soon as we find a point where the frequency is less than uh, k and greater than 0 that's the point of our split so we will again generate a smaller substring iterate through it and generate the maximum answer out of it for the second part we will increment our start pointer and continue the same process till we don't reach the end of it that's it so let's quickly code this up creating the frequency array since there will be 26 characters the size will be 26 and creating the char str array s2 for char c i'll iterate through the str array integer index that whose frequency needs to be incremented frequency of index plus plus and let's iterate through the array of the string again also let me just take a variable valid that tells me that there is no valid character uh, where the whose frequency is less than k so let me just take a valid variable to true and let me just iterate through the array again so let me just call this as my end or current let's, let's call it end end is less than s dot length end plus plus and let me just take another variable as start so this is a two pointer approach that i am following and let's calculate the frequency of end if frequency of str of end minus a is greater than 
and less than k that means it's the point of split for us less than k what uh, what we will do we'll generate another substring string substring equals to s dot substring and the start will be the start end will be the end and we will calculate let me just create another variable max length that tells me the maximum length of our interested algorithm and max length equals to math dot max max length comma longest substring substring comma k now i have reduced the problem uh, to a, to a, to that of a lower length and let's do the same thing on the smaller substring now and otherwise i'll move ahead with my start pointer so start becomes end plus 1 because we need to increment the start now for the second part of the string and also i'll update my valid to false if my valid is still true that means there was no character in the string where this condition is met i'll return the length of the string otherwise i'll return math dot max max length comma s dot substring over the start longest of longest substring of the the last part has to be taken into consideration hence i generated uh, the last subset of the substring and passed k there let me just check if the brackets are correct that's it so let me just run this once i think there's there are some typos index and substring line number 16 i hope we are good now 3 it passed let me just submit it done we are done now let's talk about the complexity of the solution so every time uh, you are generating a new substring out of a bigger string will lead to complexity of order of n square and hence the solution has a total complexity of order of n square because you are moving one pointer from the start till the end and again generating the substring and again doing the processing on one part of the substring which will cause time will higher time complexity of order of n square thanks for watching the video